It's a heavyweight showdown between Fabricio Verdum and Rashad Evans. And now our tale of the tape for this heavyweight fight. Verdum is two years the elder. He weighed in at 231 pounds. He will have a two-inch reach advantage. Here we go, first round, you ready? You ready? Let's Here go. we go. All right, Sugar Rashad Evans, the former champ, ready to go for round one. We'll see if he can get off to a good start here tonight. The first round finishes came early and often when he began his MMA career, but only one since his third professional fight. It came against Chael Sonnen in 2013. Rashad Evans ready to go as he takes the center of the octagon. That one hurt. Joe, how do you think he approaches this challenge? Rashad has speed and some vicious power in his right hook. Evans gets the takedown. In full guard. Outstanding pressure from top position here by Evans. Caught him with a punch. Oh, and now an elbow up top by Verdun. Looking for a triangle, throws one leg over the shoulder. Now it's deeper. This triangle is getting tighter and tighter. He might have to tap any second And now. there it is. Oh, my God. Great job. Didn't waste any time. Took this fight to the ground and got the early submission. Well, yeah, Joe, that was fun while it lasted. He told us he wanted to be at his most efficient here tonight. He certainly didn't waste a lot of time. He knew he wanted to get the fight to the ground. He gets the early takedown, and the submission follows shortly thereafter. And here's the end of the fight. And one more time, beautiful technique here on this triangle for the victory. And one more time, nice technique here on this submission. So there he is, your winner by submission. That could hold up as one of the better subs of the year. Near perfect execution tonight. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mario Amasaki is called to stop for this contest at one minute, 50 seconds of the very first round. To playing the winner by top out due to a triangle choke. Well, don't tell Vicavalo Fabricio Verdum that he has passed his prime. The Brazilian Jiu Jitsu black belt getting it done yet again. We've obviously seen some major strides made in his striking over the last several years under Rafael Cordero. And Verdum proving tonight that he can maybe get that UFC heavyweight title back if he can perform the way he did tonight. Certainly feel like his next fight could be for a UFC heavyweight title.